Hello, I'm Luke Halliday. This is Yokai Watch toys and merchandise in general. And I thought I'd um, do a little video to show off some of this stuff. I know we have a lot of Yokai Watch fans on the uh, old website of ours. So I thought I would show some of this stuff off. So, first of all, I'm going to show you things I got in Japan first. So these are Japanese merchandise. Now this one is a uh, Jibanyan in uh, living form plushie. Now this one I got from Hobbyco. It was a um, Ben Presto plushie they made. And I've also got my Yokai Watch 2 uh, 3DS case. Now this is for the original 3DS. Now, on to the really fun stuff. We got the uh, finally Hasbro has released their um, Western version of the Yokai medals. So uh, a lot of different medals here, but the the grand finale, the big boy himself, the English version of the Yokai watch. So pretty cool, if you ask me. Should come in a bit closer there, lovely camera lady. And watch, watch. Oh, oh. oh making sounds. And flips open as well, so that's that's a close up look at the watch. Now, uh, the watch. Many people wonder, what does this watch do? What what is this watch? It doesn't tell the time. No, it does not. But what it does do is uh, let's let's choose a medal. Who am I going to go with? I'm going to go with uh, let's go with Jabanyan, the classic Jabanyan. So you go to the medal, and these medals are sold separately. You do. It does come with. Um, the Yoko watch itself came with uh, Jabanyan and Whisper. Alright, so let's let's try Jabanyan and Whisper since those are the ones that come with it, so. Alright, so Jabanyan's pretty busy and won't be summoned. So, um, one thing that I was very confused about when I got this watch, first of all, now on the packet of the watch, it says, does not tell the time. Okay, fair enough. But it doesn't actually specify that it doesn't actually summon yokai. So I was a bit disappointed about that. Um, no actual yokai were being summoned today. But one thing that is quite interesting about it, is um, it does have a different sound effect for each different yokai tribe and each different yokai itself. So I'm going to put Noko in of the Slippery Tribe. And that's what Noko has to say. Noko, Noko, Noko. Now this one is the Heartful Tribe. We've got, uh, I think his name's Stepper. He's from the Dancing Trio. If you watch the anime, it's a very funny episode of those three. So let's see, here he is. Alright. So, I will show one more. Who will I show? I'm going to show one of my... My probably my favourite, um, Komasar. We got a little bit of close up on Komasar. Let's go for a Komasar. After this, I've got two Yokai metal packets I'm going to open up as well. So, okay, so if you put it in the wrong way, it says uh oh uh, oh, uh. and if you've seen that episode of the anime, you know why that is said. Oh, okay, I put it in the wrong way again. I normally wear glasses, which I'm not wearing right now. Okay, yep. There we go. <laughs> Third time's the charm. Fourth time. Oh my swirls. So Komasan's probably my favourite one. Um, so unlike the, uh, I will comment on the watch itself. So unlike the uh, Japanese watch, the Western version of the watch is a lot more. It's much bigger. For starters, um, now this is the you know the lens, but unfortunately, 
Unlike the Japanese one, it doesn't have the blue light, so it's not exactly accurate to the anime. Um, and also, unlike the Japanese one, it actually does not summon yokai spirits to battle for you, so unfortunately it does not have the power to summon yokai, which I must reiterate, does not happen in this form of the watch. Now, I will unlock some little bags here, and, or open up. So, it's going to come in close, just for those... Um, BDSM, I mean, um, what's the, what's the, not BDSM, what's the sound, people like the sound of things opening? Let's go with BDSM, you, you BDSM fans out there, come in close. Okay, how? I got muscles, trust me, believe me. Right, I think I'm going to need to summon a yokai to help me open this one. I reckon Ruff Raff will be able to help me. So let's summon Ruff Raff. Thank you very much, Rough Raff. All right. Looks like I have attracted a uh, friend. Okay. To the yokai. No, you're standing on my yokai poster. Okay. This comes with the watch, by the way. It's a poster, so it's a nice little poster. Enough about that. So let's see who I got. Now, thanks to Rough Raff, I was tough enough to open the packet. Now, first up. Let's, let's, let's play them all through. So first up, I've gotten... Tattletail. Alright, so let's give Tattletail a bit of a whiz. Roll her in. Interesting. Very insightful. Alright. Next up, who we got next? Move this aside. Next up, we have... Alright. Let's move that. Alright, so... You, on the second part of it, of the packet... So on the packet you get one normal, you get another normal, and then below is a hidden one. So you can't see the hidden one originally. So it looks like I have... I think it's either Old Fortune or Old Saint Trick. I can't remember his name exactly. I won't reveal the other one yet. Let's just give him a whirl. Everywhere heartful. Old Fortune. Old Fortune, there we go. So he, um, I don't know care about. Now, who was the mystery one I got this time? Oh my god! Guys, I just got a rare drop here. I got Venoct. Shiny Venoct. Rare drop right there. Wow. Okay, we need to give Venoct a go. Let's pop him in. Slippery. Okay, he just says his name. Okay, very insightful. That is a very rare one, Venox. So I, I'm very pleased with that one and happy that it was opened on video so people believe it was real. Now let's try and open again. Oh. There we go. Still tough thanks to Ruff Raff. Alright. Okay, so I've got a, um, another stepper on this one. So stepper I've got a double of now. So I might trade that one off. Let's open him up anyways. I won't play Stepper since I just played him before. Alright, on the other side. Ooh, okay. So let's open that. Won't reveal the special one. Alright, so I believe this one is called... Um, uh, four Eyes something? Foresight? One like SB. It's got four eyes. <laughs> let's find out. We'll find out what her name is. So let's pop her in. In four. There we go. Did she say anything else? In four. Okay, no, just says the name. Alright, so who's the next one? Who have we got, guys? 
And we have another Noko. Okay, so I've already got Noko. I already showed Noko, but we've got now two Nokos. Noko is quite rare on its own, so I am quite happy to have another one. It's a good trading one, but I'm definitely over the moon about Venok. So that is, that's a very good find. I want to play him one more time just because he's so good. Slippery! Van Oct, Van Rocked. All right, so I'm gonna give my overall thoughts of the um, Hasbro toys. So I generally think that this is quite a good product, this um, Yopo watch, and I'm sure a lot of uh, kids out there will have a lot of fun with it. I mean, I'm enjoying collecting the medals, personally. The, the watch, while it does, you know, play sounds and all of that sort of stuff, I do wish it had a bit more features, like the Japanese ones, such as the light and all of that. Now, uh, Hasbro has announced they're bringing out a, um, another watch, which is they're calling the Yo Motion watch. That's the um, watch from the second season where, in the series, uh, Wispaster, you know, put his mouth around the watch to um, transform it. Um, so, I will say this much, the metals are quite nice quality. In a, they come in a pack of three for six dollars in Australia. I'm not quite sure of American prices, but um, for me, six dollars for you know it's about two dollars each for them. That's not too bad of a price. I'm willing to pay it, uh, especially when they can. On the back, you can see there is a QR code which you can connect with the app and all the other sort of stuff, and I believe the game as well. So that is um, quite a nice little feature to have, and I think Hasbro has done a good job. I don't have the little toys as of yet or the compendium. If I do get those, I'll show them in a separate video. Um, but yeah, I do just need to finally reiterate. If you're buying this thinking that you'll be able to summon Yokai, unfortunately you're going to be sorely disappointed like I am. Um, because unfortunately Yokai are not real. And um, that's the harsh reality of this world that we all must face. But... If you can just deal with that, you can listen to some cool sound effects of Yokai songs and Yokai saying stuff. I will close the video by um, calling Whisper, our friendly neighborhood Yokai butler. Okay, is that my service? I do want to say one thing. I'm pretty sure Whisper is of the Slippery Tribe. So where's his Slippery song? It's just not there. Anyways, that all said, um, I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know in the comments below what you think of Hasbro's medals and their Yokai watch and their Yokai poster and the Yokai little metal bags, which I think are pretty cool actually. I, I like to look at the bags. So, yep, like, favorite, whatever the term is these days subscribe check us out more videos on the video watching machine and check out snapfurdy.com for more cool things that i and other people do on that website <laughs>